the cage with this oh, shield on. Sweet. Oh, that's good because I was going to say that's the biggest risk in here is getting so, ponied and then suffocating. Generally, one person will stay behind again as an anchor. I'll stay behind. You can rush with Farvo, okay. and it's like straightforward process. No sarks, straight to the boss. And the if one thing I'll say anchor. though with with the trench is you kind of use abyss logic at first because you know there's a. It's not going to be two rooms and you're at the boss. So when you start rushing, especially the first few rooms, you start to think, which path would actually be further for me to go? And then you follow those ways. And then, mm. But it's still, you might run into a dead end, so it's kind of just feel your way through. Okay. I'll have to go to air. <laughs> so yeah. if you see me stopping, it's because I'm on air. Him. Yeah, <laughs> when he's on air, keep that in mind, because you can't rush without air in this one. I'm paralyzed. And, <laughs> <laughs> and if you're and if you're still not cloaked and I'm on air and, and cloaked or something, <laughs> then you'll be like my best friend and you'll be bringing lots of shots at me. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm paralyzed. I barely moved at all. Okay. You can teleport to him now. He's not tele cloaked. Yeah, you can teleport to me now. I'm actually whenever he's cloaked. I, you probably already know, but you can't teleport to him. Like, okay. It's not possible. Yeah, this room's safe. It's just Slurms Mackenzie. Um, I'm gonna. Keep going here. Okay. Oh, that's a big pony room with confused orangs everywhere. I assume you're probably. Oh, hey, look at you. Yeah. Okay, there are two ponies in there, and. Tell her about the ponies, too. Yeah, tell me about the ponies. Okay, so ponies, as beautiful as they are, they're deadly. And they're, they're going to be shooting, I think, four shots in different directions and each shot is going to paralyze you and if uh if it's there's a couple loop. of them if there's a yeah they keep shooting if there's a couple of them in there even if you're cloaked they'll still be shooting them they just won't jump onto you if there's a couple in a small room it's almost guaranteed you're going to get hit with one unless you're really really going to be a, you know dodging through it or like cloaking through it so i'm going to try to go in there and plane walker over them and get to the next room Okay. And they're the worst. In this rush, in the ocean trench, the only thing you really have to worry about, besides air, are ponies. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so do you mind if we do go in, if you cloak before we enter the room? Sure. Okay. Ready? Yep. Let's do this. Okay, tell me when to cloak. Now? All right, yeah, you can cloak now. I'm, I'm already All through right. the room. It was a small room, but it was... Uh, I'm paralyzed. Uh, okay. I got through. Here's a big room with ponies, so you get one more room to experiment with, with things. Fast. You're like a, a Tony D, 150 words per minute. Yeah. I am pretty fast, I have to say. He can type that fast? He uh, no, not that type, fast. He oh, says he can Tony type that D fast. Can? I can only what type. What the hell? Oh. We have some strange players. Strange? That's not human. Ooh, 70s, you know, when I Don't was Don't in... say I suck, that's so... <laughs> oh my god. That's excellent, man, you know it's excellent, too. No, everyone who's good, like Chrono, is like, oh, 100 words per minute, no problem. I'm like, oh, oh okay, well, I feel bad. <laughs> okay, so I, I'm... Not. Is it okay if I just run? Yeah, yeah, go rush it, and then we'll um teleport on the boss. Yeah. So... Just like we do the forward slash teleport and you put in your anchor's name. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually, why don't you do that? Forward slash tell space black gem and just have it in. Don't press enter. Just click okay. outside your text box so that it's just resting there. Okay. And then do you have it? Yeah. I have okay, it. now double and press enter twice. Oh, did you have the command in? I did. It says usage tell player name text. Uh, Forward slash tell space black jam didn't work. It, it it's yeah it's saying usage dot slash tell player name text. Huh. I wonder if there's like a different thing for GMs. Maybe it gives yeah. Okay. So anyways. I mean, I can just teleport by clicking on the name. So. Well, I was just gonna show you what the anchoring thing is, but yeah, I think you get the picture. Um, yeah. When people go in to fight this boss, sometimes she goes into dying Thessal mode, and you'll see it if she does. And they'll already have the phrase typed out, which is, he lives and reigns and conquers the world. Okay. And like that's how you 
Sure. What, what is that for exactly? It's it's only a very rare occurrence where she, instead of dying like usual, she doesn't die, and she's like asks, asks she a has riddle. a query for yeah. you, and then yeah. you you respond to her. With he lives and reigns and enters the or enters oh, conquers, conquers the, world. the world. Yeah, that got a little bit risque. Yeah. Um, <laughs> So Anyhow, that was you'll a dead hit end, the phrase, you. Right and back. she'll say, thank you, kind sailor, and throw out gifts that you shoot open. They're like orange balls. And you shoot open, and you have a great chance of getting white bags. Okay. But if you don't say the phrase, and you keep hitting her, she'll um, or say something other than the phrase, she'll say, you speak lies or something, and yeah. then shotgun and kill anyone who's standing beside off. her. <laughs> That's why everyone wants us to spawn Thessal when we're uh, you know, anywhere. Yeah. That and O2, of course. For coral bows. Yeah. I'm lagging. But that's fine. Don't. Just ignore me. <laughs> Continue to discuss Vessel. I agree. She's fun. And with tombs, when somebody... if Unless someone buys a key and opens it, what they usually do is pay... They'll find a player that has a key and pay them one life pot to open it for their group. Okay, that's it, the trade. Yeah, and what happens is everyone will fight the boss... And then if they get more than – if they get two or more life pots, they'll give whoever opened it, whoever bought the key or paid for the key, they'll donate to that person one of their life pots if they get two or more. Well, that's nice. Yeah, and that's how it works. It's a generally. good system where the person who opened is kind of being rewarded for that. And you're you've already been rewarded for coming with the chance to do the bosses and get some loot for yourself. So. Cool. Yeah. I wish I kind of wish keys were tradable because then my friends who do buy keys um, wouldn't get there'd be no risk of scamming. They could just pay a li you know a life pot or whatever for the key mm -hmm. and trade it. Um, I'm you at the see boss. How, you see you how close he is to the red dot on the map. Generally, when players get into this, like yeah. in the public uh, ocean trench, they'll watch the rusher and how close they're getting to that red dot because once they get there, that's it. The vessel dies within like a couple seconds, generally. Because there are way too many people. people. <laughs> yep. So then we teleport to him right now. Yeah. So let's teleport to him. I'm clearing this room because, in case Oops. we want to back out of the main room. Excellent. Yeah. Is that's that a good cool? idea. So we do yep. the circle rotation to kill these things, or? Oh um, uh, yeah, we just I do just that dodge around, it's kill easier. them. Like all enemies generally fall into this circle pattern. Like you can just kite them, and they'll follow you, and shoot yeah. behind. And the reason he's clearing this room, I guess you probably already know, is that when we get into the main room to fight her, if we run out of oxygen or our health goes down, you want a safe area. And that air, that room is not safe because okay. there's these giant squids that will <laughs> guard the air holes. Here's one of them right here. Okay. Yeah, the re the real when you, real air holes. <laughs> and when you kill them, <laughs> they respawn. Okay. So they it's have... like no point in clearing them. It's just kind of avoid them. And there's incidental damage all over the, the fight, like those little things she just threw we'll out. We'll go in and shoot her. And these these are just regular attack. Her boomerangs will armor break. And if yeah, you those get ones. with one of those, that's these you guys. want to get out. because. Explain what armor break is. That just means that your armor you have... is no good right now? Yeah, you have zero defense. No matter how much defense you used to have, now you have zero. Okay. You're like a totally fresh uh, level 20 without any armor on. <laughs> and no death pots. Yeah, no death pots drank, so. Okay. And then to kill her, you just keep shooting at her, right? Yeah, we'll keep yeah. doing that. She has another phase, I think, right? Yeah, one she's more gonna, phase. once we get her down enough, she's going to start shooting more frequently. She's going to be shooting out these these um big Circle. circles of shots, which are hard to dodge. You can plane walk over them if you want, or just eat one and run straight at her. It's your or call. back up. Here she goes right now. Yeah. You'll back I... up to the air hole, and the, the shots spread out enough so that you can walk through them. I think it. And can you imagine if we got a dying Thessal? That'd be great. Do you have it ready? Yeah, I do. Cool. I do not. I want dying Thessal. A slacker. <laughs> great, because then we can just chill. No! What the hell? What, what happened? happened? I don't know. Oh, you got I'm... kicked? Yeah. Aww. Shit. Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, that's my life. life. Oh, no. Damn it, it might have the best life gym would be. Well, well accidentally was well, sorry. Cut 
Um, wait, so what was I going to say? You're rotating. Like, rotating works so great. I mean, you really have to have that down pat. Because if you can do that, you can weave in and out of anything. Okay. And an abyss would be a great example of um, that. How the monsters move. I thought you left too far, but I'm like, what the? No, oh. I just, I was lagging out, like, big rubber bands, so I left yeah. the main room. Yeah, generally, someone will not clear the room before this, like Farvo did. Oh, shit. I got a white bag. Yay. <laughs> That's nice. the first white bag I've ever had from her and not her gifts. Really? Yeah. That's... Okay, so I got an ink, a monopot, a coral trap, and a coral sea silk armor. <laughs> All you needed was the bow, and you'd have I the know, thing. damn it. <laughs> Would have been cool to get a treasure. I haven't gotten a treasure from her yet. Oh, I I've haven't only gotten, gotten the tomb anything. ones. Okay, so did you want to see a different? Man, but, uh, Just run through it all. Abyss. 